My name is Ramon Jimenez. I'm an attorney. I'm a, one of the coordinators of the South Bronx Community Coalition. And I'm, an, I'm a candidate for Attorney General under the Freedom Party. Yeah. I wish that I could believe that this meeting was what town meetings were originally intended to be. A meaningful interaction between you and the public where you listened, where you learned, and where you made decisions based on what they said instead of based on what you think. Uh, I'm a rider. I ride the subways and the trains two or three hours every day. I ride the six train. I ride the four train. I take the 40 bus. I take the 42 bus. And I just want to. I just want to say. Let me just give you an example. On 161st Street, for people who are over a certain age or have disabilities, you walk up the stairs. On Yankee games, there's always a bus, there's always a token booth operator. When there's no Yankee game, there's no token booth operator. You walk up the stairs, there's no token booth operator. You go to the machine, the machine says no cash. And you gotta go downstairs, and you walked upstairs for nothing. Try, try taking the 6 train on Cypress or Brook Avenue at 11 o'clock at night. And I, I just wonder, when, if someone dies over at Brook Avenue or Cypress Avenue because it was unattended, do you guys feel anything? Do you guys feel, do you guys feel any accountability when people get hurt? Nobody there? There's no safety? And, and my question to you is, you know, you know, I know that you guys are not, don't take trains, I know you're used to the suites and the limousines and all that, but do you, do you feel anything at all for, for what the ordinary person here in the South Bronx goes through? And, and you know, my, my question, you know, again, the TWU as a rider, every day, I can say that 95% of the bus drivers, the token booth operators, you got some right. of the best workers in the United States of America. Thank you. Seven those workers. You should, try, you should use every method you can. To, I mean, these laid off workers uh, you know, have done excellent jobs for you. And my question to you is, do you feel this? Do you understand this? Do you understand the anger that's in this room? Do you understand the fact we resent the fact that there's no black and brown faces there? We resent that. Yeah. We want to know. We want to know again. Do you feel if tonight, what go uh, someone on Cypress Avenue gets killed because there was no token booth operator, the eyes and ears of the public, the protector of the public, do you feel that?